we all the way over in the military lane now. So now we got to play warfare mentally to unravel who we fighting against that's keeping us in the condition. So mm -hmm. we search documents and we find stuff like the papal bloody decree that you showed. So they, they made the oath public and now somebody exposed it. What do they call it if you got one drop of Negro blood in America? What do mm -hmm. they call America the great melding pot, right? What do you do in the melding pot? You mix ingredients together. And the ingredients they mixing together is enforced through some people known as eugenicists. Remember the opposites attract I told you was going to come back up? This way it come back up. They do scientific experiments on the uncanny attraction of black men to white women. And in their studies, they determined originally that the standard of beauty of the black woman was so great that they couldn't overcome that obstacle and compel them to amalgamate with a white woman. And in contrary to that, back then, when they did the analysis, they couldn't figure out why the white woman didn't find the black man attractive. So what do you put between two repulsions in order to cause them to contract together or to draw together? You got two opposing forces. You need something to interrupt or to draw the two forces together. So now the only way you can do that is you got to have something called a reverse resistor, which is going to in turn invert the current of one and, or, and automatically draw it to the other. What do everybody you other fucking want? What they can't fucking have. Right. So how do you enforce getting these people together. While we at war, they telling us to stay away from white salad, right? Remember, George Wallace was the governor, was running for governor in Georgia. And he stood up there with a group known as the KKK. And he was adamant that we will protect the sanctity and purity of the white woman at all costs. We understand the dynamic of the KKK and their origins, right? Because they come from Barcelona, Spain, and the Black Hand was the grand dragon that led the hordes in uniform with cone heads across the land. I told y'all before they use pale faces to block institutions to keep out the uh, friendly faces to keep us out of the institutions. But they got the secrets and they hiding in the lodge, 32 degrees, Scottish Wright, Albert Pike, Adam Whitesharp, George Washington, two ball came flip. They tied that shit all together in the Masonic Lodge. And now they use reverse psychology to draw two people that didn't even have any affinity for one another together because they told them they can't have each other. Because mm. now the eugenicist is telling you that they trying to get rid of the birth defect. Dr. Francis Quest Wellesley told them exactly what the defect was. And it stopped them from having the right to a sin. Mm. Big mama don't like it that. She said, you don't throw people away like trash. So, all this time, we've been thinking that we was the last that was about to be made first. We was living as last to the ones that was last that Big Mama made first. Because they did the dirt, the good had to suffer with the bad. One bad apple spoiled the whole motherfucking bunch. When you get so comfortable living in opulence lifetime after lifetime, it's exhilarating to have the resistance of the struggle in mm -hmm. order to make your God form shine brighter than it ever had before. But first you got to wake up from the slumber. So the devil is in place in order to use the law because it wasn't over here. Before they came, we didn't have no prisons. Big mama smarter than motherfuckers. Mm hmm so what did she do? Because we didn't know how to break from under the curse. Because they was doing the blood ritual 
that was making us incapable of learning because it kept our brains in a stupor, a spell of sleep, because the angels can't function in a state of fear. The fear caused all of our auras to shrink in on themselves and created our own hell and bow down to something inferior to us because we failed to go within to find out who the fuck we was. The historical record pieces being put together, the genetic uh, practices is also being spoke of in ancient times. And the scrolls that tell the story directly and indirectly all say the same thing. They say exactly what Baba said. You motherfuckers ain't getting punished for your sins. You getting punished by your sins. <laughs> okay, now that's going to have a lifespan and it has to come to an end. It got to come to a grand finale because this shit can't continue on. So we look around the world and find, is there any more melding pots? Brazilianization is the mixing up of a genetic pool in order to clean the birth defects from an inferior stock by the royal blood from across the land. The South American priest was the least infiltrated and the most effective in recovering Yakub's grafted devil. Because how did they say, Elijah say they had to, how did they get, have to get rid of him? Reverse engineer him. So if they need one drop of blood, that's enough to give them a right to a sin. Because now they can raise the sacred secretion before they can only operate on what's called the silver liquid, which is what they call cerebral spinal fluid. And it's heavily infused with colloidal gold, colloidal silver, and other essential trace minerals and um, metals. It's not until the soft metals come into the body, what we call toxic metals, that interferes with the harmony in the system of allowing the secretions to rise. That's why they be putting all that metals in our shit. Yeah, when they man. said they didn't have a soul, it mm -hmm. was because the calcification of the channel that allows the sacred secretion to rise, they couldn't raise the liquid from the base of the spine to the head. And it caused them to short circuit and blow a fuse, right? And mm -hmm. it causes them to operate on the lower three chakras. They can't get past that. All they need is one drop of blood to clear the channel. So mm. in the eugenics was all the time telling the public that they was trying to keep us apart. They was actually behind the scenes promoting interracial relationships in order to clean up the genetic defect and allow the people that didn't have the right to ascend to have now have a right to ascend. So now we understand why we tolerated all of that bullshit, because at any given time, under our oppression, we could have rose up and took over, but we didn't know it. 